Here's the Google homepage in Australia. It should be noted that I'm using Firefox. Firefox is the world's third most used browser after Google Chrome and Safari. I know it's only got 3.65% of the market share compared to Google's 63.63%. It just shows you how much dominance Google has over the internet. So anyway, when I search for SBS News, an Australian public broadcaster, we get the following results. Facebook, Twitter and Wikipedia. As many of you would know by now, clicking on the Facebook link results in essentially a blank page. There is no news here due to Facebook's Australian news ban. Going back to the Google search, I was surprised to hear from a lot of people that they were able to find SBS News via a Google search. Knowing that Google Chrome is the world's most used browser, instead of using Firefox, I decided to give Chrome a go. Lo and behold, the SBS News website is the top search result. So what's going on here? Why are Google playing silly buggers and not allowing Firefox users in Australia to easily search for the SBS News? Well, if I just unblur this little message here, News Showcase now has more than 73 partner publications in Australia. Read the news. I guess they either want Firefox users to give up using Firefox and just use Chrome, or they want to herd us towards their new News Showcase. Anyway, clicking on the link, it doesn't even actually take you to any news. It just takes you to a Google blog outlining all the benefits of News Showcase. So where can you see the actual news? Scrolling down quite a way, it says, where does it appear? The Google News app. Google News Showcase story panels are now live in the Google News app. Okay, so it looks like I can't even access this News Showcase on my laptop. They want me to download an app on my phone or whatever. Well, forget it. I'm not doing it. Google are playing this stupid game of find the news and quite frankly, I'm sick of it. They use all these little manipulative mind tricks to get us to use their products. They don't want me using Firefox. They don't want to make my life easy. When I do search for SPS News, they don't even show me the actual website. But if I use Google Chrome, no worries. Suddenly, everything works again. As long as you do what Google say, everything is okay. Google and their ilk keep harping on about how all these new laws will break the internet, but the only people breaking the internet are Google and Facebook and many of the other tech giants. They want to be in control. They want to have all the power. They want to have all the money. And when they don't, that's when they start breaking stuff. Thank you.